Hey everyone, Daniel Castles here with Right Home Realty. And uh, we're gonna teach you today how to use these grommet kits. Um, they're great, and let me show you why. So you might be thinking to yourself, why do I need to know how to use a grommet fastener, I guess is what we call it, or a grommet kit? Well, the reason why is, because you never know when you have a sign like that to hang up on a fence line. Or maybe you're trying to tie down something with a tarp, and you just don't have enough holes in the tarp, but you don't want to put any in without protecting the hole from fraying. That's what these would be used for. Grommet kits are fairly cheap, and uh, I think these were about $5 a piece, and they're, they're brass, um, so they won't rust, which is very nice. They do have other ones that are out there that are tin um, that might rust, so just choose wisely when picking what grommet fastener um, you're going to use and and uh, make sure that um, you take your time when you're putting it on. So as you can see, this is what a grommet is. It goes around the bottom of a sign or a tarp and they kind of smash into place. Um, this is what a sign looks without one here. And we're gonna put one in right here. And, and luckily for us, this has a little dot here. They don't always do on signs, but it really helps to hang uh, hang up signs and, and um, this one's actually for my church, so it needed a few. They came with top grommets, but not bottom ones. So I'm gonna go ahead and put those on now. So that side should look like this side in a few steps. So the tools you're gonna to want for this job are a hammer, a block of wood that's fairly flat, a good working surface that you can uh, use to hit the hammer uh, on that won't move. Um, you're gonna have your material that you're gonna to wanna to punch the holes into and one of these grommet kits. Uh, this one's a Bosch grommet kit here. It comes with a uh, the hole punch, the flange, the two parts of the flange, and then it comes with a couple of brass grommets. That's what you're gonna wanna use. Uh, so with the hole punch, you get an end that has a sharp edge and an end that has a dull edge. Put the sharp edge towards the material and where in the spot that you want it. As you can see, I have it kind of in the center of that bottom pocket. And now you hit it with a hammer. And then we just hit it a couple times to get this punch to go all the way through. Um, and I've already punched the hole uh, in the piece here, um, as you saw. So I like to take the grommet, and this one goes on the front side uh, of the material that you're working on so it would go in like that but I like to take it and even though this is the wrong side to use I thread the grommet through the material using this uh, like so that way it doesn't bend the brass as you can see there all I gotta do is push the brass through the material now it's a little bit easier to do this way I push The side from the, the side that I want the front to be on. It should look like that when you get the material through. So now I have the the stem of it of the grommet coming out this way. The front has that nice curve to it. And I take the back ring. And it has a bevel to it. You want the uh, inside bevel here going down. Just like so. This piece actually goes on the back side. One with the stem. And then you have this piece on the front side. You line up the rings. And you want to hold on the material. We'll give it a couple good blows. As you can see, the bottom piece just comes off. Then I kind of twist this a little bit because it gets tight. But as you can see, there's the back ring in the front. And that's how you do it.
So if you like the how-to videos, go ahead and let us know below by liking, comment, and subscribing to our page. And also don't forget to ring the bell. Um, I've got more grommets to put on these signs, so I'm going to let you go, guys. I hope you have a great day, and God bless.